Hi everyone, this is Killshot from 99 Gamings, The Walking Dead Comics, issue number 95, Red Explained, aka Comics with Killshot. Catch up really quickly on issue number 94, Jesus has taken Rick and group up to meet the people of the hilltop. Also, very special announcement, you guys know we're counting down, getting closer to issue number 100. If you guys at 99 Gaming could get over to 99 Comics, make sure you subscribe over there. Also to 99 Plays, we're adding a lot of new content over there, and for issue number 100, you will only get the completely unfiltered version of Negan on the 99 comics page so check that out I'll still do the toned down version on this one but we're also adding a lot of gameplay on the 999 plays page so so many different things going on would appreciate you guys would subscribe to each of those channels and also we're gonna be planning Easter eggs and different videos on all channels so the live stream tonight will actually be the first time we're gonna do a iTunes card or a Google Play giveaway and it's gonna be a question related to a video in a different channel so here we go let's get into issue number 95 and see what Rick has in store today. So that's it? Yep. Okay. So what now? I'm just supposed to take my people, trust you, walk into a situation where we're completely outnumbered? How could I do that? Rick, I let you tie me up. I risked my life to prove I wasn't a threat to you. I could have attacked you in the van while you were sleeping last night. What's it going to take? You're just going to have to trust me. I can't. I just... I'll put Andrea on the van. I'll have Michonne by my side. Glenn can take Carl somewhere safe. I'll meet your boss, whoever's in charge, but he's got to come outside alone. Then what? You hold him prisoner and come inside? That's just not going to work, Rick. We have to be able to trust you, too. He's not a bad guy, Dad. I can tell. So his people aren't bad, either. Okay, take us inside. All right, then. Van won't make it up the hill with the ground so wet. We'll have to walk up. But I'll, I'll let you in on a little secret. We ran out of ammo a while back. I'm going to let you carry your guns. That makes me feel a little better. Michonne, on it. Shunk. I'm an idiot, really. She said she's been giving me all kinds of signals. I don't even know what that means. Looking at me, being nice. How am I supposed to pick up on that? Whatever. It worked itself out. We're going to have dinner together tonight. Have you met Mandy? She's... Heads up, Eduardo. What is it? Cal... Is it Negan? Oh, the first time we hear the name Negan. Shh. Wait. Is that? Stand down, Cal. It's me. Have someone open the gate before we draw too much attention to ourselves. Jesus, you know I can't do that. They're armed. Take their guns before they try something. Stand down. You know I'm in charge of who comes in. I vouch for them. They're cool. Open the door. Sorry. These guys get a little antsy standing up there doing next to nothing all day. The worst part of holding a cool spear all day is that you're just dying to actually use it. Follow me. Here we are in the hilltop. Impressive, right? Yeah. Wow! As I said, there's almost 200 people living here. At least that's where things were when I left a few weeks ago. Probably more now. I had at least one pregnant woman here. That room on top, whatever it's called, you can see in all directions for miles. So it's kind of perfect security-wise. This is the Barrington House. Every elementary school within a 50-mile radius took a field trip here at least once a year. Dismantle part of the barn to make the wall. Made it big enough to include the nearby watchtower. Nice. Got additional metal sheeting from other barns and houses in the area. Or so I was told. Place was up and running by the time I got here. There were half as many trailers here back then. Had to expand a few months back. Come on, let me show you the house. 
place is run pretty much like a hotel. Most of the rooms have been converted into living quarters, even the ones that weren't bedrooms. Some people prefer to have their own space, like out in the trailers. Others like being together in one place, feel safer. I'll show you around. Jesus, wait. Show the rest of them around. I'd really like to pull aside whoever's in a position of authority in this new group you found. Bend their ear a little. A real meeting of the minds, okay? I'm sorry, guys. Please, meet Gregory. He keeps the trains running on time around here. He's the guy making sure everything is on the up and up. I'm the boss. Rick's the guy you want to talk to, man. He's good people. I vouch for him. It's a pleasure to meet you all. Please, Rick, accompany me. We'll keep him safe. Go. Nice family you got there, Nick. It's Rick, actually. Y yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, sorry. So, what kind of place you hold up in? Nothing nearly as nice as this, I assume. Well, no, but I know. This place is pretty impressive. It's taken a lot of hard work on my part to make this all possible. But it's hard work that's really paid off. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah, I'll have someone take you around, show you all the hilltop has to offer before dark. For now, tell me a little bit about yourself. Well, I used to be a police officer before, and there's a couple of police officers here. I'll introduce. Wesley, what's wrong? It's Ethan. He's finally back, but it's just him. Come on, Ethan, you're safe now. Where's David, Crystal, and Andy? What happened to them? They're, they're dead. Was it Negan? Did he do this? Said it wasn't enough. Said we weren't meeting our end of the bargain. They still have Crystal. Said they keep her alive. Return her to us if I delivered a message to you. Message? What message? I'm sorry. Shuck! Gregory! Off me! I have to! Rack. Ram! No! No! He has to die! He dies or Crystal dies! He's bleeding out. Someone get Carson. Let go. I don't want to hurt you. Someone grab him. What the freak are you doing? Stay back. Stay back. Anyone who tries to stop me is killing Crystal. Shrek. can't do anything out here. We need to slow the bleeding so we can move him. Put your hand on the wound. Apply pressure. Dad? I'm, I'm fine. What? And that is where we leave it. Pretty quick comic read there, but a lot of information in there. So, very, very similar to the TV show. We got Ethan coming back to Hilltop, stabs Gregory. Uh, then we finally get introduced to the name of Negan. So uh, really excited to see what's going to happen in 96. Maybe that's where Rick actually shows a little bit of confidence and says they'll take out Negan. Leave your thoughts. Leave your comments below. Uh, as I said, this was under 10 minutes, so relatively quick, but uh, pretty excited about the future of this. And once again, I will have some bonus content over on the 999 Comics page. Look forward to seeing you all over there and also in a live stream a little bit later on. My name's Killshot. Peace.